Hello and welcome back to Undertale. Let me see. So, I don't think we've talked to any of anyone here yet. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. All right. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. All righty. Um, yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome. She's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. Haha. <laughs> I wonder who her is. Uh, okay, yeah. Save. That's a save point. That's what that is. Sans. What? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. <laughs> I'm going to Groby's. Wanna come? Yeah. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. <laughs> Me too. Over here. I know a shortcut. Sans with their shortcuts. Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hiya, Sansy. Flirty. Hey, Sans. Weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? Nah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Me too. Here, get comfy. Sans is me. Relatable. Whoops. Watch where you sit down. Sometimes where it does put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? Fries. Burger sounds good. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Grillby, we'll have a double order of burg. <laughs> Me too. Next time next time I go to McDonald's, I'm gonna be like, can I have a double order of burg? So, what do you think? I'm my brother. Cool. He's pretty dang. Of course he's cool. It'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. <laughs> I'm dead. I love papyrus. Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Mmm. I'm good. More for me. Wow. Nice sands. Just chugs the whole bottle. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries real hard. He does indeed. Like how he keeps trying to get, be part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. <laughs> God fucking damn it, Papyrus. But the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's, uh, still a work in progress. That did a kid of a pirate. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? I have indeed. So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them, and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me some something interesting the other day. Sometimes, when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Fuck that. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Fuck, yes. I will protect Papyrus from that bitch flowing. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away for, from work for that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? Sure. It's just 10,000 G. Yeah, totes. Just kidding. Will we put it on my tab? Those are some expensive burgers. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. <laughs> that is literally me. Thanks, Sans. Okay. Well... Um, so it looks like Papyrus has gotten himself in some shit, and we have to protect him. Innocent Papyrus. Oh, hello! So you came back to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. <laughs> Alrighty. Here we go. JK. <laughs> Back again. My house. I can't believe. 
God fucking damn it. Um, well, here we are. Pyrus's house. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. <laughs> what a what a loving, loving papyrus. It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sands, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. <laughs> oh, it's my favorite game show! Metaton. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't touch me. <laughs> That's literally me. Always. <laughs> you touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You get 20G. Fucking score. To steal from... From the brothers and I. My brother always goes out to eat, but... Recently, he tried baking something. It was like a quiche. But filled with sh a sugar sugary... Non-egg substance. How absurd. <laughs> There's an empty pie tin inside the stove. Oh, he was making a pie. <laughs> Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. What? Catch that meddling canine. Curses. Sand, stop plaguing my life with incidental music. That's the trash can. Feel free to visit it any time. Wrecked. Wrecked by Papyrus. Thanks, Fab. Uh-huh. Interested in my food museum? Please. Peruse my culinary art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Why would a bag of chips be in the fridge papyrus? Why? There's a book over here. It's a joke book. Take a look inside? Yeah, sure. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. Yeah, probably good. Welcome to Scenic My House. Enjoy and take your time. You got it. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. That's a bone. The door is locked. That must be Sans' room. It looks like it's on fire, but maybe it's just a wild party going on in there. Who knows? Um, that's my room. If you finish looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Let's do it, Papyrus. Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday, even though it basically just happened. Uh, wow. Car bed. What? That's so dang. That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair. Sun on my skin. You don't have either of those things. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. Nice. Ah, uh, yes, action figures. A great reference for the theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa! Amazing. Isn't that flag neato? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. Yeah. <laughs> Makes sense. Totally evolutionary virus. That book's one of my favorites. Advanced Puzzle Constructions for Critical Minds. The next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. <laughs> I'm dead. The internet, I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double digit follower count. What? Papyrus. You have negative two followers? Of course, fame has a steep price. 
A jealous troll has besieged my online persona. Always sending my bad me bad puns in a goofy font. Man, I wonder who that could be. Probably the same person who got you all those figurines over there. There are no skeletons inside my closet. Except me sometimes. Look in the closet? Yeah. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Okay, well that was boring. So virus. So, um, have you seen everything? Do you want to start the date? Yes. Okay. Dating start. Dating start. Here we are on our date. I've actually never done this before. But don't worry. You can't spell prepared without several le several letters for my name. I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one. Press the C key on your keyboard for the dating HUD. C. <laughs> Wowie, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Reel it in. Oh, I'm... Okay. Step two. Ask them on a date. Ahem. Human. I, the great papyrus, will go on a date with you. Yes. R really? Wowie. I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three. Put on nice clothes to show you care. Ooh, wait a second. Wear clothing? That ribbon in your hair. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You've wanted to date me from the very beginning? Yep, totally. No! You planned it all. You're way better at dating than I am. N no, your dating power. Off the charts. Nyeh. Nyeh. <laughs> Don't think you bested me yet! That tension. I, the great Papyrus, I've never been beaten at dating and I never will! I can easily keep up with you. You see, I, too, can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes, just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! <laughs> yeah, what do you think of my secret style? I love it. It's, it's so dank. No! Look, his fucking shoulders are basketballs. Ballin'. A genuine compliment. <sighs> However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. The state won't escalate any further, unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Ooh. I think I found it. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and perseverance. Yeah, okay. Fine. Human souls are stronger than monster souls. But the souls of our shoes, on the other hand, are about the same. <laughs> okay, hands. Holding my hand so I'll tell you the answer. No, I must resist. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. You right. I see, I see. You like caressing my biceps with a floating heart. But who doesn't? My hat? My hat! My hat! Yeah. Oh, it's a present! Well, well then, you found my secret! I suppose I don't I, I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you! Fuck yeah, I'll open it. Oh my god. Do you know what this is? Of course I know. That's some spaghetti. That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right. But oh so wrong. This ain't any old plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silken spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. I'm gonna eat it. I'm gonna eat the crap out of it. You take a small bite, your face reflexively scrunches up. In pleasure, of course. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking. And by extension, me. Maybe even more than I do. <laughs> wow, that's a lot. <laughs> no! <laughs> Over nine times. Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I, um, boy, is it hot in here or is it just me? 
Yep, it's totally you, Papyrus. Oh, shoot. Human, I... I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Wrecked. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. That's, that's literally the same. But alas, I, the great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll, I'll keep being your cool friend and act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday, you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. Thanks, Papyrus. What a good friend. <laughs> oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonically. Well, gotta go. Yeah. Guess he's gonna be calling Papyrus all the time now. And, and he just disappeared. Rip Papyrus. Well, I guess we'll go ahead and call Papyrus. I miss him. Ring, ring. Snowden, home of Papyrus. That's the slogan, right? <laughs> Absolutely. Okay. Now... No. Yes. Okay. Gotta go back over there where we saw Sans, but actually continue on this time. Hmm. Yes. I don't really remember this place. Okay. Yep. Sans is still here. Hello. Let's hang out again sometime. Sure. I'll save. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Okay, and then let's go. And uh, there's a box there. I don't think I really need it though. So I'm gonna just go. Grass, shadows, spook. Oh, there's, there's our good friend Papyrus. Uh, hi, Undyne. I'm here with my daily report uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? Did I fight them? Yes, of course I did. I fought them valiantly. What? Did I capture them? Well, no. I tried very hard on thine, but in the end, I failed. What? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But Undyne, you don't have to destroy them. You see? You see? Oh shit. I love you, Papyrus. Thanks for, thanks for trying. I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Oh shit. <laughs> well, okay. I guess I fucked up there. Hello. Uh, okay. I mean, there's no nothing to see here. No worries. No worries. Okay, laters. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, hello. Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? Yeah, I did. I did. I saw that. That was awesome. I'm so jealous. What do you do to get her attention? Haha. <laughs> Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. Alrighty, let's do it. Let's do that. Um, hope hope I'm not the bad guy. A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. Okay. Yep. Let's just grab these and put these over here. It's all good. I should probably read that thing first. I'll read it. When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. Okay, thanks. There we go. Lit. Built myself a bridge. Oh, hello. Aaron flexes in. Oh no. Aaron, please. You flex. Aaron flexes twice as hard. Attack increases for you too. Flexing contest? Okay, flex more, winky face. 
That's weird. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Ready for my next flex, are you? You flex harder. Aaron flexes thrice as hard. Tag increases for you too. Nice. I won't lose though. Winky face. Uh, Aaron is a creep. Okay. Well, here you go. He flexes himself out of the room. You won! I got some golds. That's pretty lit. Okay. Um... Cool, cool. Good. Yes. Lit. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? Well, it was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. <laughs> so, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a faded ribbon. Is that true? Are you wearing a faded ribbon? What will you say? Yep, I am indeed wearing a faded ribbon, Paris. So you are wearing a faded ribbon. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day. <sighs> okay. Wishing room. That's what this is, I suppose. Um. Wash, wash. Shuffles up. Clean. Let's get. Let's get clean. You ask Washua to clean you, he hops around excitedly. Green means clean. Okay, so we gotta get green. Green! Shit! No! Okay, well, fuck. Um, let's have some monster candy. Wash you leg. What? Oh my god, oh my god, drip. Okay, well, yellow. You ask Washua to clean you, he hops around excitedly. Green means clean, alright. <laughs> Shit, I died. <laughs> Rip. That's depressing. Okay. Man, when was the last time I saved? I don't even remember. Oh yeah, I'm Vajnib, I forgot about that. Oh, I don't want to die again. Green means clean. <gasps> oh! No! And I got the green too. God damn it. This shouldn't be so hard. Come on. I might just have to clean. Clean me, please. Oh, oh no. Oh. Okay. I'm just sick of this. Wash away. No! Fuck my life. I could. I was gonna spare. So I could get a stuff for it, but. I guess not. So upset. I'm done. I'm done with this game. <sighs> oh, wow. Okay, thanks. Hello. Please, you know, I'm having a rough day, and I don't really feel like this right now. Okay, listen. Maybe we can just, like, talk about this or not, or just leave. That'd be nice, too. Holy shit. Oh my god! Boy! I'm gonna, am I gonna have to go through all that again? I don't remember there being a save. <sighs> okay, no, okay. Thank Christ. Okay, here we are. <sighs> Sick of this. We're just gonna do it this time. I. Okay. Alright. Yep. Mmm. Mmm. It's always where it fucks me. Starting to go up and down. Oh, God. Gotta go fast. Go fast, go fast, go fast. Oh no! <gasps> oh, 
Okay, 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 okay. This looks promising. Grass. Tall grass is nice. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, boy. Damn. <laughs> shit. Rip. She's just holding him by the eyeball. What the heck? Um, later Undyne. Hope that kid's okay. Okay, well, we're stopped, so. Yep, there he is. Looking excited as ever. Yo, did you see that? Undyne just touched me. I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky. If you were standing just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. Yep, let's let's hope. Okay, we'll hear some cheese and shit. Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical crit magical crystal, it fills you with determination. Yep, indeed. Now I am determined. Determined to continue. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally fifty thousand G to use this premium telescope, but since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Yeah, sure. This is a real shit telescope, Sans. Oh. Wow, nice one, Sans. Huh? You weren't satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. <laughs> Thanks. Um. Okay. Oh, hello. I relocated my store, but there are still no customers. Fortunately, I've thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a free ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. That's cool. It's a frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 25G. Yeah, sure. Looks like you're holding too much stuff. Oh well. Okay, well, bye. Hmm? Don't need that then. Uh, hello. What are you? What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? No. No, no, no. You can't do any of those things to it either. Okay, well. Let's, let's get out of here. Speeding away. Flowers are everywhere. Everywhere. I think we go this way, actually. Hmm. Ugh. Okay. Bye. Light. Okay. Um. Ooh. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Yeah, sure. Carrying too much. Okay, well, now it's depressing. Um. I guess. I'll just eat that. HP is maxed out. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Yes. You got the ballet shoes. Okay. Now ballet shoes. Let's equip those. Now I'm wearing the ballet shoes. And let's drop that. Abandon the tough glove. I guess that's my weapon now then. Interesting. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. I remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know. Her opinion of you is very murdery. But I bet you knew that already. And because you knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing. A faded ribbon. Because I knew, of course, after such a sus suspicious question, you would obviously change your clothes. You're such a smart cookie. This way, you're safe and I didn't lie. No betrayal anywhere. Being friends with everyone is easy. Click. <sighs> you know, I, I appreciate the thought, Papyrus. Watch well. Fuck you. Okay, well. Clean me, please. Green means clean. Yeah. No. God damn it. Just please. Green, green means clean. 
Oh, it went in the exact same way, and I still, I still miss them all. Clean is what green means. Oh, finally got one. But I'm at five health. Okay, well I got gold this time. Okay, well let's just go this way. Uh, yeah. Okay. Hello. What's up? Hello. <laughs> hey there. Notice you were here. I'm Onion San. Onion San, you here? You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Okay, Doki. Even though the water is getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time, but uh, hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. That is so sad, Onion San. And the aquarium is full. Uh, anyway, so even if I wanted to, I. That's okay, though, you hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Yep. Hey there, that's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. And waterfall. Yeah, okay, okay. That was depressing. Now. Oh, hello, Shiren. Um, let's hum, let's hum a tune. You hum a jazz ballad. Shiren follows your melody. Okay, 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 okay. Ah! Shiren seems much more comfortable singing along. Okay, bye, Shiren. Okay. Here we are. Um, there's a piano over there. Hmm. Okay. You know, that's a that's a whole thing. Uh, but I have a set place I want to end this video in, and we just don't have time. But um, I'll let you know that it's not really worth your while. Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome. Let's go. Yep. Okay. Little monster kid can't carry one because he has no arms. Poor monster kid. <laughs> Alright. Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night knowing she was going to beat me up. Haha. <laughs> Alright, well. Right. <laughs> Indirectly right by monster kid. Hmm. So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking, yo, how cool would it be if Endine came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. <laughs> wow, so responsible. Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. I agree, you know. Um, I mean, she's tried to kill me a few times, but that's understandable, I guess. Taking in the view. I like how it's like, they're not stars, you know? Because they're like hanging from the cave ceiling, but you can tell. And it's like, yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yeah, I feel that. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Put up your umbrella and climb on my shoulders. Okay. Return the umbrella. Put back. You return the umbrella. Okay. Thanks for the lift. Yo, you can go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. Alright, see you later, Moss Kid. Oh, and the save. A save thingy. Probably means it's gonna get intense, right? The sound of muffled rain on the cave top. It fills you with determination. Save. Okay. More of this. More of this then. Yep. Oh. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, that's not cool. That's not cool at all. 
let's go ahead and let's go ahead and get going, yeah? Shit. Okay. This way. Just miss that. Oh no. Shit. Just gotta get gotta get going quick. Okay, well fuck. Oh shit, dude. I'm just doing all the wrong things. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything over here. Okay. Pfft. Shit. I am so dead. Oh my god. Rip. Rip. I've died so many times this episode. Cannot give up just yet. Badge nibs, stay determined. Oh, it's getting so hard. So hard to stay determined. Okay, well, let's try again. Uh, I gotta just choose the right path. Don't know which one it is. Yeah, okay, okay. I've seen this all before. Let's, let's, let's go. What's up? Okay. That's cool and all, but I, I think I'll pass. Um. Trying to go fast, but also trying not to just run into shit. Okay, not that way. Um. Perhaps this way? Um, not that way. It's getting faster too. Shit. We're so fucked. Okay. Okay. This is- <gasps> Oh, I got excited. Okay. Here we is. This is a big area. Feels better than... Feels like we've accomplished something. Okay. Yep. Yep. Shit. Okay. Heading on back. Heading on back. It's all fine. It's all fine. It's all fine. JK. JK. Oh, what's up? What's up, girl? It's been it's been a while. Okay, well shit, bye. Rip rip me. Oh. And that's how Fajnib died. It sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Badge name, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... Gotta keep up that mystery. And it's on a bed of flowers again. Wow. Oh. Okay. Here I am. Wow. Um... Yes, thank god. Save. Uh... Okay, so this is a trash zone. Got you. Okay. Oh. It's a cooler. It has no brand and shows no sign of wear. Inside are a couple of freeze-dried space food bars. Take one? Yeah. Got the astronaut food. Okay. Um. Wow. Fantastic. Hello. Ha ha ha. It's just like you to run away. I'm a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin used to live inside a dummy too, until you came along. When you talked to them, they thought they were in for a nice chat. The things you said. Horrible. Shocking. Unbelievable. They spit them right out of their dummy. Human, I'll scare your soul out of your body. So angry. Mad dummy blocks away. I don't want to fight you. Fetal, fetal, fetal. Okay. Ah! Okay, well that wasn't good. Shit. 
Ow, you dummies. Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks. Hey, you. Forget I said anything about magic. Uh, nervous. Okay. Well, let's hang on to that. I'll defeat you and take your soul. Right. Get him. Lit. I'll use your soul to cross the barrier. Wild. <laughs> nice. Oh shit. I'll stand in the window of a fancy store. <laughs> nice. Some pretty lit dreams. Who wants to be a model? Then everything I want will be mine! Okay, well shit. I keep getting a hit over here. My dummy is getting caught in all over the dialogue box. Okay, I'm gonna eat some bicycle. You eat one half of the bicycle, you recovered 11 HP. Huh? Yeah, I guess that'll average my cousin. Okay, well, there's those now. Shit. Real struggle. What was their name again? He doesn't even remember them. He's like over here, like, avenging them or whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever! My dummy is getting caught all over the dialogue box. Pitiful, pitiful, pitiful. Oh shit. Oh, I got hit by one. Okay. Feudal, feudal, feudal. Got you. Hey guys! Dummies, dummies, dummies! Remember how I said not to shoot at me? Well, Failures! You're fired! You're all being replaced! Ha 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 ha! Now you'll see my true power! Relying on people that aren't garbage! Amazing. Mechanical words fill the room. Shit. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and take that unicycle. Nice. Dummy bots magic missile! Okay. What up? Mmm. Wrecked. Mad Dummy is bossing around its bullets. Dummy bots, try again. Okay. Ooh. All right. Lit. Okay. Dummy bots, you're awful. Question mark? Question mark? Question mark? Okay, that's not so great. That's not so great at all. Holy fuck. That was really bad. <laughs> oh no. Final attack. Okay, oh my god. Holy shit. No, 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 no. Oh my god. I'm so dead. Oh no. Shit. No! Oh. God damn it. Vajnib, stay determined. Oh. No. <laughs> Okay, that's not good. Shit. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. Everything's- everything's fine. This is fine. Okay, oh my god. Holy fuck. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, no- no way! These guys are even worse than the other guys! Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? I don't need friends. I've got knives! Oh shit. <laughs> I'm out of knives. But it doesn't matter. You can't hurt me and I can't hurt you. You'll be stuck fighting me forever. 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 Ah ha 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 Oh. W what the heck is this? Acid rain? Oh, forget it. I'm out of here. Right. Oh, hey, friendo. Sorry, I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, your friend immediately left. Oh no, you guys looked like you were having fun. Oh no, I just wanted to say hi. Oh no. Me too. Sad and obstacle. Well, I'm going to head home now. Oh, um, feel free to come with if you want. 
But no pressure. I understand if you're busy. It's fine. No worries. Just thought I'd offer. I'll, I'll head over there. Maps bloop. Hey, my house is up here. In case you want to see, or in case you don't. You feel a calming tranquility. You're filled with determination. Lit. Um... That doesn't look like Nafs Book's house. Okay, well here it is. Uh... What's up? Oh, you really came. Sorry, I wasn't expecting that. It's not much, but make yourself at home. Uh, do you want to listen to some tunes or something? Let's check out your fridge. Oh, are you hungry? I can get you something to eat. This is a ghost sandwich. Do you want to try it? Yeah, sure. You attempt to bite into the ghost sandwich. You phase right through it. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Me. After a great meal, I like to lie on the ground and feel like garbage. It's a family tradition. Do you want to join me? Yeah, sure. Okay, follow my lead. Here we go. You'll lie down as long as you don't move. So, only move around when you want to get up, I guess. I guess we'll just hang out here for a bit. Feeling like garbage. I mean, you died so much. Oh. Dude. I'm, I'm fucking stoned. <laughs> what was in that ghost sandwich, Nasta Luke? Okay, well, I guess I'll get up. <laughs> well, that was nice. Thank you. Yeah, th th thanks, Nasta Luke. Um, I had a great time. Later. Okay, and then let's go ahead and save. You feel calm and tranquility. You're filled with determination. And then let's head out. Mm -hmm. Maybe... Hello. Uh, I'll buy a crab apple. Okay. That's all I can carry then. Be careful out there, kid. Let's head out. Hmm. I love the music in this game. <laughs> like, so much. Okay. Here we go. Gotta light up the path. Um, and we'll, like... Uh... Oh my god. Hey, Temmie. Oh! Stop. Tell me, please. Okay, um... Uh... No, muscles are not cute. Oh, I have to disagree. No! Just the two of us. And now I have to fight him. I can't believe this. Okay. Um, but, like, uh, we will, we'll, we will go back later and, like, we'll ask, um, the turtle all the questions and everything like that, um, at later time. And we'll look more around here. This is Temi Village. I love Temi Village. Temi Village is dank. But we'll talk to everyone there and do all those things. Um later, but they will get done. <laughs> Just not this episode. Because I have plans for this one. And then... Okay, sweet. Okay, well... That's kind of spooky. This one isn't moving around or anything. You approach Mold's Fall. Suddenly... Ooh. Okay, hello. Shit. Hello. Okay. Um, gyrates reservedly. Um, unhug? You don't hug mold but big. It appreciates your respect of its boundaries. Roar. <laughs> Me too. Okay. Okay. 
This is fine. Okay, bye. Um, yes. This way. Piece of wing. Okay, shit. Gotta press those lamps and keep it, keep going. <sighs> if it gets dark, we are screwed. Oh my god. Oh my god. Both of you are the worst. The absolute worst. So I'm leaving. Bye. Okay. Well, shit. This is where we die. Rip. Okay. We can make it. Yay, we did it. It was all because I believed. And now it's dark again. Spooky. Oh, okay. Behind you? Excuse you, that's creepy as fuck. Oh, hey, Andine. What up? She's stalking towards me. Seven. Seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king. King Asgore Dreamer will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, humans? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. Uh, no thanks. I'd like to keep my soul, please. Undyne, I'll help you fight. Yo! You did it! Undyne is right in front of you! You got front row seats to a fight! Indeed I do! Indeed I do. Wait. Who's she fighting? Oh, right. Hey, you aren't gonna tell my parents about this, are you? Well, later. Thanks, Monster Kid. Um... Okay, quick quick escape. Here we go. This way, this way, this way. Uh huh. Okay. Ugh. These paths though. Yo. Um what's up? Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're human, right? Haha. <laughs> Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now, I mean. Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of stink at that. <laughs> so, um, say something mean so I can hate you, please? Yeah, sure. Huh? Yo, that's your idea of something mean. My sister says that to me all the time. Guess I have to do it, haha. Huh? Yo, I... I hate your guts. Man, I... I'm such a turd. I'm... I'm gonna go home now. Bye, Monster Kid. Oh, shit. Yo, wait, help! I tripped! Okay, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you, Monster Kid. Just stay put. <laughs> You good? You- Yo, dude. If- If you want to hurt my friend, you're gonna have to get through me first. Protected me. I love you, monster kid. Best- Best friend five ever. She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies was just a nice thought, huh? <laughs> we'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. Later, dude. Bye-bye. That was nice. I love that kid. It's unsettling that there isn't any music playing now, though. Oh, hey. What's up? How'd you- are you like Sans? You teleport too? Seven. Seven human souls, and King Asgore will become a god. 
Six. That's how many we have collected thus far. Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as is customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. No. You know what? Screw it! Why should I tell you that story? When you're about to die! Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, girl. You! You're standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams. Alfie's history books made me think humans were cool. Cool. With their giant robots and flowery swordsmen. Anime. But you! You're just a coward. Hiding behind that kid so you could run away from me again. And let's not forget your wimpy goody two-shoes stick. Ooh, I'm making such a difference by hugging random strangers. You know what would be more valuable to everyone? If you were dead. That's right, human. Your continued existence is a crime. Your life is all that stands between us and our freedom. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts pounding together. Everyone's been waiting their whole lives for this moment. But we're not nervous at all. When everyone puts their hearts together, they can't lose. Now, human, let's end this right here, right now. I'll show you how determined monsters can be. Step forward when you're ready. Okay, well, I'm gonna save first. The wind is howling. You are filled with determination. That's it, then. No more running away. Here I come! On guard. Okay, well, I don't want to fight. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face danger head on. You won't last a second against me. Okay. So, yep. Block it. Cool. And that important heroically towards the sky. Not bad. Then how about this? Wow. Wild. And then towers threateningly. For years we've dreamed of a happy ending. And then flashes a menacing smile. And now, sunlight is just within our reach. Okay, a little faster now. But we still good. Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the ground with her fists. I won't let you snatch it away from us. Okay, well that's nice and all, Undyne, but I don't think this is the right way to go. Undyne holds her fist in front of her and shakes her head. Enough warming up. Okay, well, shit. Oh, that was close. Okay. A knight holds her fist in front of her. Yep. Oh, shit. I can flee now. Running for my life. Oh my god. Okay, you won't get away from me this time. Undyne attacks. Honestly, I'm doing you a favor. Okay. What's that favor? I'm dying. No human has ever made it past or Asgore. Okay, well, shit. Um. She draws her finger against her neck. Killing you now is an act of mercy. Okay, I don't- I don't want it. I'm dying, but thanks. I'm dying thanks to her friends. So stop being so damn resilient. Holy shit. Oh my god. Okay. 12 HP edge. She flips her spear impatiently. I can flee again! Run! Run! Oh no. You've escaped from me for the last time. Okay. Alfie's told me humans were determined. Okay. Undyne bounces impatiently. I see now what she meant by that. Okay. Those yellows are gonna fuck me up real good. But I'm determined too. Oh yeah, I can tell. I can tell, Undyne. Okay. Okay. Determined to end this right now.
Oh my god. Okay, we did it. Right now. Okay. Shit. A dying suplex is a huge boulder just because she can. Right now. Oh my god. No, no, no. I'm gonna die. Shit. I should have. No. Oh, I should have taken some footage or something for that last one. Badge nib. Please stay determined. <sighs> okay. Okay. Yep. Okay. We're gonna need some uh, crab apple right now. <gasps> no! 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 Okay. Um. Ice cream. Ice cream sounds good. You're super spiffy. Your HP is maxed out. <laughs> okay. 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 Shit. We're fine, we're fine, this is fine. Die already, you little brat! Okay, 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 oh shit. Oh my god. Rip. Okay, flee, 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 flee. Oh, f god damn it. Papyrus, please. Hey, what's up? I was just thinking, you, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. I think you would make great pals. Yeah, we're we're getting along um, um, swimmingly. Uh, let's meet up at her house later. Yeah, sure. Like how she lets me take my call. Stop running away. Boy, I'm out of here. Later. Oh, hey, Sans. This lady's trying to murder me, but it's chill. How <laughs> she talked to stop to talk to Sans? She's sleeping. Um, what's up? Armor, so hot, but I can't give up. Cause she's a fishy and it's hot over here. Look at that lava down there, damn. Okay. Yep, okay, I'll take a cup of water. Here you go, Undyne. Uh, you tried to kill me, but, you know, I'm a good person, so here you go. Mm -hmm. You good? Um, what up? Why did she leave me alone? Good idea. Good idea, Vatch name. We did it. And there's a save! See such a strange laboratory in a place like this. You're filled with determination. Lit! So, that was, that was where I wanted to stop. So, oh my fucking god. Boy, okay. So that was the end of this episode. And next episode we'll see what this uh this here laboratory is about. And it'll be dank. Until then. Bye bye.